Hello, I'm Abby. I'm Tim. And behind us, we've got a Ford Transit jumbo van, which we're going to hopefully turn into a camper van. Yeah, we've not done it before, so we'll see how we get on. So, this is the first part of our van conversion, basically, we're in the van. It is a 2017 Ford Transit. It's the L4 Jumbo longest one you can get, and H3 um, highest one you can get, which is, we, we got that, that's one of our main requirements, was that I could stand up in it, and I'm around about 6'2". Um, so we're hoping we've got enough height here, that even when we've put in some ceiling and floor, beam insulation, I'll still be able to stand up. So, fingers crossed for that. Fingers um, crossed. It's quite clean, as you can see. Uh, we got pretty lucky on that. No visible rust that we can see yet. We're going to be taking out the uh, side panels today and the floor, which we've never seen behind or under. Um, so we'll see what happens there. We might have to do something. We'll treat that a little bit uh, if there is any rust there. And we'll be taking out the headboard possibly today, possibly uh, tomorrow. We'll see how we get on with that. But other than that, yeah, basically, we've got a good blank canvas. Um, just got to get started. So. Got the, the um, drill, screwdriver, <laughs> um, and we'll get going. All right, let's do it. Okay, first screw coming out. Yeah. Let's do it. Almost. I'm not very handy with the drill, but there we are. That's it. <laughs> Officially started the conversion. <laughs> Do it. Put some welly into it. I'm trying. <laughs> it's down here somewhere. It's you nice. sure you haven't missed a screw somewhere? Hang on. Oh, it's um. Oh, do we have to take those out first? Yeah. <laughs> Bugger. <laughs> so hopefully I've got it to a stage where it's coming out. Let's just see. Aha! There we are. Cool. Now I've just got to do that. It came out pretty easily, didn't it? nine more times. <laughs> right, panel removal, let's go. Yeah. Woo! We've got well, First time we've seen under there. Looking really clean under there, isn't it? So we've uh, been taking the panels off. Uh, most of the screw is coming out really nicely. Um, this big one can't get out because of the wheel arch one, which is basically stuck and glued in there. Unfortunately, hit our first problem. There's just two screws left on here, which do not want to bud. And it's just burying the top, so I think I'm probably going to have to drill those out. So on the other side, the box over the wheel arch had the same problem with the two screws where they're just completely stuck in. So the two that come through the um, the wheel arch into the right into the underside, you see them here. So we're going to try another strategy of trying to just use some mole grips and grip on them and see if we can twist them just enough so that we can go back up to the top and do them properly with the screwdriver. So we'll see how we go with that. Okay, mole grips didn't work from underneath. Um, it's just you can't get in there to get a good grip around it because of the shape of the wheel arch. So, plan three, what we're going to do is try and just break this piece off and leave enough of the screw, hopefully, to come when the snaps off, there'll be enough to just uh, grip around that and pull it out. So, just going to try it. Oh, that's one bit out. <laughs> Put 
arms on for this bit. That's it. Right, let's see if we can just tease it. There we go. Coming, isn't it? Yeah. There we Yay. go. Hey. Little bugger. <laughs> <laughs> so after finally getting uh, these screws out, which took a little bit of doing. We went to then get these panels out, which unfortunately I think are sort of wedged in place with the floor panels. So that's our next job. The only thing I'm worried about is whether they're going to have the same problem as we did with the wheel arches screws. Um, hopefully we won't, so we'll see. <laughs> Fingers crossed. So we've started taking up the floor, um, annoyingly again most of the screws have come out fine but on this panel, it's divided into panels, on this smaller panel which is just this bit, just two of them here and here are being really stubborn, bird again so whoever put these in definitely didn't want them to come out again. Um, because we want to keep this piece of floor, at least for now, because it's useful to put back in if we need to go and get things in the van. We're going to try and drill the top of this out and then hopefully, because the other one came out so easily, we'll just lift up the board and then we can use the mole grips again to get that screw out. Let's see. Oh, hello. Oh, there we go. There we are. Sweet. There's the culprit. Hopefully, we have to get the floor up. Mm. See, I'm leaving the first time. Oh, hello. Oh. Floor. <laughs> we have a floor. We do have a floor. And a few little nubbins of screw sticking out there. Where is it? Yeah, there. So hopefully we've got just enough sticking out that we can get those out now. Yep. Give me a good clean. one panel that we've had to drill out and uh, the last one has just broken our drill bit. That's how wedged in they are. <laughs> ah. Or maybe we've just got really bad drill bits. Maybe, <laughs> I don't know. So I think we're going to have to use a different one, hoik that out and then hopefully we'll get the panel up. <sighs> this has taken way longer than I thought it would. <laughs> so we've uh, been a pause from the screws tonight. We've been attacking them for the last few hours and... Uh, it looks like we haven't really done anything It <laughs> looks like we it's haven't cool. done much. If you look around there, there's still a lot of board, um, not much white metal showing through, but we've managed to get probably about three quarters of them out. There's just two stubborn ones on that bit and we're drilling them out, obviously, the ones that are stuck. Uh, we've broken our drill bit, so uh, yeah, have to um, get another drill bit and uh, pick up again tomorrow. It's ridiculous. <laughs> oh my gosh, they're so stubborn. Ah. Come on. No, it's not turning anymore. It's not going to turn, does it? So we got it out. Just clean it out one more time. Much effort for each one. 
<laughs> which it kind of is, snackering. Okay, Abby's gonna see if she can get out the wall. Hi, Billy. Ready, steady. Yay! Woo! Well, that was easy. <laughs> the ceiling at the bottom was quite strong, so getting the floor out really helped loosen that. And there we go. We have a wall. So we're finally down to our last screw to remove from the floor and then we can take it all up, take out the last bit of wall and uh, get every, everything out. It's been taking a while because uh, we realised a lot of our drill bits are actually blunt. So we switched out as one of these ones, it's getting a lot better, being able to drill through that a lot easier. Um, we've got, actually got quite a few of them out with the screwdriver today. And yeah, just get this one out, get the boards out, and let's see. Okay, let's see if we can get that out. There we go. Nice. Easy that one. Last screw is out. Final bit is out. Hello, floor and spider. <laughs> A little bit of extra wood there for some reason. Let's get rid of this. It's quite heavy. It's quite a lot of dirt that was under those floorboards, which is quite amazing considering it's only from 2017. So we've given it a sweep, we've given it a hoover, and now we're just giving it a bit of a clean with very liquid. So we finished cleaning up the walls and the floor and it's looking really nice, really shiny. Who knows how long it will actually stay like that, <laughs> but it allowed us to see where all the holes are and things like that that we need to know about to, uh, to fill. So. Yeah, it's looking great. And now that we've got the, um, the walls clear, we can actually measure up our insulation, which we couldn't do before because we didn't know exactly what the panels looked like behind. Thanks for joining us and we'll see you next time. <laughs>